Good morning, we are up and going and eating breakfast. Bella has school today, Natalie has ballet, so it should just be a nice leisurely day around here. We've gotta to go to Target at some point to pick up some things, but other than that, regular day to about ballet. <laughs> Bella's excited about school. Those are excellent work that she brought home yesterday. She drew a pretty rainbow. And I did quality work on it. You did do quality work Sorry, on it. Sorry, packaged up Isabella's lunch for the day. Been sending a banana for AM snack and some veggie straws for the PM snack. So we got a ballerina in the car today, and Bella's on her way to school. I wish I could see you guys' outfits because they are cute. In case I need something. Natalie apparently found a pen while we were driving here. This is no side case I need something. It's in case you need something, like Mulan. No more watching Mulan, apparently. Honey, you can't draw all over yourself. Because I need no in case I need something. Oh, oh ballet, Natalie. You you had a good day of dance class too. You're gonna fit your shoes in. All right, so Bella and Natalie and I are gonna go into Target. We've got a short list of things to grab. So we are back home. I'll show you real quick what I got at Target, and then we're gonna eat lunch real quick. So I got a, well, I got one more of this Lacroix uh, curate stuff. Curate. I don't know how to say I it. <laughs> yeah. Um, I got, it's the Palm Baya one, Apple Berry. It's really, really good. I'd planned on getting actually two or three of them, but this was the last one that the store had because they're on sale this week. So I got this Simply Balanced one. It's Blueberry to try this brand as well. And I'll look at another Target for that. I got the girls some more Halloween cookies, a little jack-o'-lantern to put in their lunch. This is a different Target than we've been at recently, so I got this little gymnastics leotard in a size small because that's Bella's size and this was originally the one I was wanting to get her but the other one yeah the other ones didn't have it and then I had to get the kids conditioner so we are going to try this for the first time it's so cozy super hydrating berry whip conditioner this was in the kids section um, in this shampoo section in Target if that makes sense it was in the regular shampoo section but they have a section just for kids stuff and then we like this Daniel Gavin Jr. Galvin Jr. Um, watermelon shampoo, but they don't make like they just make a spray and conditioner and I like using like a leave-in or you know a rinse out conditioner. I'm hungry. I don't know. I can't think. So then we got um, cinnamon bread. The kids like that. Some more bananas, some more blackberries, and then we also in the Halloween section found these cinnamon and sugar Pata. sweet potato corn. Pata. Pata. I can't remember. A banana. We found these cinnamon and sugar uh, tortilla chips. They look pretty good. So we are going to eat lunch. Lunch, exactly. See what this is? It's a banana. It is a banana. I got lots of bananas. You did get lots of bananas. I got lots of them for you. Thanks. This one's for you for that. Holy pearl, these things are amazing. These are the Archer Farms brand, so I think you can only find these at Target. They were in the Halloween section. They're really good. If you like a churro, you're gonna love these. It's like a churro in a bag. It's amazing. So Natalie's back for another snack and she just watched the episode of Super White. We've gotta run out and go get some gloves for donations. So we got our Amazon order yesterday, so I'm gonna get this kind of dispersed, hopefully a little bit, and then we're gonna go run out, get those gloves to take to the donation thing, and then it'll be time to go pick up Bella. <laughs> Natalie's pretty excited. Her frozen decals were in there. We also got Super Y, the Cinderella one, because we didn't have that one yet. I got another one of these Junior Encyclopedia of animated characters, so each girl has one now. For me? For you, yes. I got some of these tongs. These are nice to have in the kitchen just to pick up like things out of the toast thing or whatever. And mine had broken. I got some more of this, or not some more, but I, my Whole Foods doesn't carry this watermelon comfort aloe thing, so I ordered a case of those from Mommy, Amazon. What's this? That is a frozen pop-up hamper that we got for Natalie's room. Let's get out. Let's there is a frozen nightlight. And then oh, these the are the decals for Isabella's room. And then this is her comforter. Mama, you got this one for me? Yep. That's no. for you. an exciting Amazon order today. So this is the stuff that I had in Chicago. It was really good. But unfortunately, I haven't found some place to get it locally yet. The cat keeps carrying around the kids' food from downstairs. This is one of those pieces of fabric food from, um, I can't get it to flip over, 
from um, Ikea. And Yoda apparently thinks that they're cat toys because he carries them around in his mouth now. They're all over the house. So we're going to run into Dollar Tree to see if we can find some just regular gloves. We couldn't find any at Target. I love Dollar Tree! Oh my god. Well, I haven't been able to find gloves at either Target, Dollar Tree, and I even stopped at Walgreens earlier. So now I have both girls from school. We get to go to my least favorite place ever. But we picked up Bella from school. Mom. We're gonna run into Walmart real quick. So we are back and I'm actually gonna get ready to make dinner because it's meatloaf so it's gotta be in the oven for about an hour. So I'm gonna start putting all the ingredients together and pop it in the oven. Well, I'm not gonna be making meatloaf because I went to go get the meat out of the refrigerator and apparently we've already used the ground beef that we had. So, I'm gonna be making something else that's in the freezer. <laughs> I don't know how I did that. I guess I got two pounds of ground beef instead of three and I just, I don't know, out of it. So anyhow, I'm gonna find something that I can make from down here. Honestly, those Philly cheesesteaks were really, really good. I like those. I'm not holding oh, the straps, so sorry, it's dangling. But those were really good. So I might just make those tonight. 